Hey, our friends, we got a really cool drawing we're going to do today, huh, Checkers? Yeah. What is it? Mario! Yeah, Mario! <laughs> All right, you got your marker? Yeah. Let's get drawing. We're going to start by drawing Mario's nose right in the middle of the paper, okay? And we're going to draw, let's draw it a little low. Okay, we're not going to be in the middle of the paper. We're not going to draw it here. We're going to draw it right about here, okay? And that way we can save some room for the top of Mario's hat because his hat's really big. And I probably drew my nose really big too. <laughs> All right, okay. All right, now we're going to draw his eyes and they're going to be ovals too. Good job. Now, and then draw the other one. You're already doing it. Good job. Okay. Now let's draw the inside of his eyes. And those are more ovals. And those ovals come all the way down to his nose. You see that? They start oh, up here and I then was... they come down here. What's that? I did this one a little more shorter than that. Oh, one, so yeah. So I was going to do that over. Oh, you're going to draw? I oh, do this one for the inside one? Yeah. I think it's OK. I would just do them inside. Okay. Yeah, that's OK. Good job. Okay, now let's draw one more oval inside. And these do, these do the same thing. They come all the way down to his nose. All right, and then we're going to draw a little circle. We are going to draw one more oval inside, and that's for the light catcher. And then color in black his pupil. Look like Mario eyes, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> All right, almost there. Got it. Sweet. Yeah. Okay. Now let's draw his eyebrows, and we're just gonna draw little a little curved line that goes over the top of his eyes, and then we we'll draw another one on top of that. Good job. Okay, and then let's color those in. Color those bad boys in. Those look like Mario eyebrows, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> awesome. Okay, what makes Mario famous? What's he famous for, I mean? His mustache. His mustache. So we're going to draw a curved line that comes out of his nose. And curved line that comes out of this side of his nose. Yes, good job. Okay, now we're going to start. We're going to start in the middle of right down here. We're going to start and put a point right there. And this is for his, we're going to start his mustache this way. And then we're going to draw a curved line. One two, three. Good job. <laughs> That's <laughs> awesome. I like it. <laughs> okay, and then we're going to do the same thing over here. One. Oh, I drew that one smaller. Two and three. Three bumps. Good job. <laughs> I like that. One. That is one awesome mustache, you. I like it. All right. Okay. Now let's color this in, and we'll have to we'll speed this part up for the kids at home, so they don't have to watch us color color his whole mustache in. That's gonna take you a little while, huh? Maybe not. All right, good job, dude. Look at that. He's got his famous Mario mustache. I like it. <laughs> okay, you ready for the next part? Let's draw his mouth, okay? okay. And we're just going to draw a, a U, and the U is going to be about the same width as his, um, as his nose. And it comes down and then back up. Yeah, good job. Okay, and then we're going to draw another curved line here for his teeth. Good. And then an upside down U in here. And then let's color this in.
I don't know if we need to speed that up. Huh. I'm already done. I'm already done too. Sweet. Good job. That looks like Mario, huh? Yeah. It's starting to look like him a little yeah. bit. <laughs> All right. Okay. We're going to run out of, out of room a little bit over here. So, but let's, let's go ahead and finish. We're going to draw the top of his hat now. And we're going to draw a big... You that goes all the way over his head. Good job. And then we can come down. We can actually come down a little past his mustache. Oh, I already did. Did you already come down past? Oh, good. Good. Okay. Now we're gonna draw his cheeks, and his cheeks are gonna, his cheeks are gonna come down. And they're going to come a little further. And then I'll draw a cheek over here on this side. And we want them to look kind of the same on both sides. Good. And then his chin. Whoops. I got excited. <laughs> his chin. <laughs> his chin. <bruh. laughs> I like it. You ran out of room. <laughs> no, that's good. That's okay. I like it when we draw things really big and we fill up the whole paper. And I think the kids at home, you guys should practice that too. You don't want to draw too small. You want to draw too things. Big. Yeah, you want to draw too things. Small. I think too it's big. better to draw things too big than to draw them too small. It's so good to I fill the whole page. I draw it bigger than the table? Yeah, bigger than the table. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. Now we're going to draw his hat. And his hat, we're going to start, we're going to draw inside. We're going to start like right halfway at his eyes and we're going to come in and we're going to draw a curved line that this is this is his hat this is part of his hat so we're going to draw a curved line that matches the curved line we already drew I know it kind of looks funny but we're going to get his hat on there and he'll look better <laughs> looks like he's got a swim cap on all right, okay, and then we're going to curve this line in. And curve this line in over here. And that's this part of his hat. That's this part, okay? All right, now we're going to draw his ears, and then we'll draw the rest of his hat. So I'm going to draw small ears on there because I'm running out of room. But you want to draw C's on both sides. And then we can draw... A line, curved line, and draw another curved line, and then color that in. Good job. Okay, now we're going to draw a curved line over here. Same thing. Another one, and then color that in. The kids at home probably want to draw his ears a little bit bigger if they have more room. But okay, ready for his the rest of his hat? And we totally ran out of room. But we're going to draw this hat, and there's going to be two curved lines that come out on top of his ears, like that. Okay, and then we're going to draw this part of his hat. And his hat gets bigger as you get to the top. Okay, and then we're going to, so we're going off the page, huh? Did you get some on the table? No. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> That's all right. We'll wash it off. It's no problem. Okay, and then we're going to come down here and finish his hat in there. <laughs> okay, what's he missing on his hat? He's missing his something. M. Yeah, he doesn't quite look like Mario until he's got his M, huh? So now we're going to draw a circle here that comes out of his hat. And I'm running out of room, so I'm going to pretend like I go all the way through and then come back. All right, and then what's, what's on top? What's in the circle? M. An M. You draw one M, then we draw a second M underneath that one. Yep, and then close, connect the two M's like that. Is that cool? Yeah. We're missing a little bit right here. We're missing his sideburns. And so we could draw two little bumps, two little bumps. I kind of ran out of room. You can color that in. And that's his sideburns. He's got wicked cool sideburns. Dude, you drew Mario. Did you think you could ever draw Mario? Uh, maybe. <laughs> you got to practice right this. Now. And now you know. 
You need to practice this so you can draw for your friends all by yourself. Is that cool? Yeah. You think your friends would like it if you could draw Mario for them? Yeah. Yeah. We hope you guys had fun drawing Mario. And be sure to take a picture of your Mario and send it to us. Where should they send it? What email? Um, my art. My art at artforkidshub.com. Yeah, exactly. Art yeah, dot com. Yeah. <laughs> my art at artforkidshub.com. Send us a picture and we may feature you in our next Monday video, huh? Yeah. That'd be cool? Mm -hmm. All right, we'll see you later, art friends. See Goodbye. Ya, art friends. Do five. Yeah. Found it. Boom. Boom.